Selena, it's lovely to see you here today at Collector Mania. There's so much excitement around Arrow. What a fantastic finale with Deathstroke and Oliver fighting in your character's name. What do you think she would have made of that? It was fantastic. I think the action of um, the last episode has definitely not let anybody down. It is as good as the beginning of the season. Like I think Arrow's done really well because it hasn't gone downhill. Um, with time, it's only gotten better and better. And I think the writers did a fantastic shot, job. Yeah. Now, of course, we know your character is sadly not in this world anymore, but it is a world where dead doesn't necessarily mean dead, doesn't it? Because people have superpowers. So how likely are we to see your character come back for season three? I couldn't tell you. If I told you, I'd have to kill you, you know? <laughs> um, no, I can't, I can't give away what's going to happen for season three, but I must say the writers have done such an incredible job of constantly surprising the audience. So... We'll see. How much would you like to come back? And if you could come back, what would you like to see your character doing in future? Um, for me as an actress, like I just want to play many different shades of, of the character and, and her role. So I think that I've been really lucky so far to be able to play such different aspects of her, which I think every person has, like the demon, the hero. Um, so yeah, I just honestly, like I just want to bring the, the writers and the creators vision to the screen and I'm happy to take on whatever challenge they throw me. Now they've got a great cast of characters, both the actors and their characters on screen. Who would you like to have spent more screen time with in the show and who would you like to have a face off with? I would love to have more screen time with um, Emily Bent Rickards, who plays Felicity. Uh, who would I like to face off with? Ooh, that's a, that's a cool one. You know who I really like? Katrina Law plays Nyssa. And she's such a sweetheart, by the way, in person. But she's a really good fighter, and I would love to face off with her. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Yeah. Love to see that. Now, we've already heard that we're getting some people back for season three. John Barrowman's been announced as becoming a season regular. What do you think about that? What do you think he'll bring to series three? John Barrowman is such an incredible actor. He has so much charisma. I'm sure the Barrowman fans are going absolutely insane that he's going to be back for Arrow. Um, yeah, we're just, we're really happy to have him back. I think we've missed him for season two, and, and it's awesome that they're bringing him back. Yeah. And of course, you've got a spin off from Arrow now as well, haven't we? The Flash. What do you think about that? Isn't Grant Gustin so hot? <laughs> um, I think that, you know, he is a great actor and he's going to play Barry Allen so well. I love that, you know, he can play the geeky guy but also the hero. I just, I cannot wait to watch Flash. Would you like to see your character make a little move sideways into the Flash world and what would you like to see her do? That would be really cool, actually. Um, I don't know if that's going to happen, but yeah, that would be really cool. I'd love to have more scenes with um, Barry. That, that would be awesome. And of course, loads of excitement around the DC world, isn't there? Um, which characters would you like to see brought into Arrow or even The Flash? And also, what do you think of the whole world of the Justice League movie coming up? Because a lot of people would like, you know, Arrow characters like um, Stephen Amell and yourself to be in that Justice League movie. Um, I think that, you know, right now there's definitely a trend of DC Comics and Marvel Comics going to the theatres. I think, you know, I think fans would be so happy to see Justice League movie. And um, in terms of characters, I'd love to see like Ra's al Ghul come in and League of Assassins. So yeah. Would you like to kind of be beside that, you know, Wonder Woman in maybe a Batman versus Superman movie as well? That would be pretty cool. That would definitely be pretty cool. <laughs> There's actually so much that, you know, people can do with the DC comics. Like, I just, yeah, I look forward to see how they kind of expand their, their um, universe, you know? And what do you think of, we've just seen very recently, a little peek of Ben Affleck in his bat suit and with his Batmobile as well. What do you think about Ben Affleck as Batman and what do you think he'll bring to the part? Hot. <laughs> <laughs> Hot. <laughs> yeah, I, I look forward to seeing that. I really do. And if you could have been any other character in Arrow, who would you like to be if you could swap characters for a day? No, I don't want to swap. I'm pretty happy with Shadow. I think that having such a strong female character on Arrow, which is great, like we have the Black Canary, we have Shadow, but also the fact that she is um, Oliver Queen Sensei is just, I mean, I couldn't ask for better. I must say I'm a very lucky girl to, to work alongside of Steven as well as Manu. I mean, they're both really, really good people and very good looking and very professional actors. It's, it's fun, it's really fun. I've learned a lot from them, from both of them, and um, they've really helped me develop my character as well from season one to season two. And finally, how much of a comic book fan were you before you became part of that world of Arrow, and how much kind of boning up research did you have to do? I did, I did some research, uh, definitely, on Shadow. I mean, in the comic book, she's, you know, 
she actually shoots a Yumi and not an uh, American flat bow. And, um, she, you know, her character was Japanese. There are a lot of differences. I did do my research to get to know her better, especially in the audition phase. And then after that, it was a matter of talking to the writers to to um, develop her character further. Yeah. It's been lovely to speak to you today, Selena. Thanks very much for your time. Nice to meet you guys too. Bye.